guys what's good how you doing i hope you are doing well welcome to vinyl tv if you are new to this channel and if you are please consider subscribing i will appreciate it thank you very much indeed for stopping by thank you very much indeed for clicking i want to show you what we got here we got this gear this is hp mv inspire 7920e this printer is multifunctional printer very good with photo printing you can print everything tackle anything this printer is all location family printing gear full features productivity and for photo never run out of ink you got six months instant ink with this gear you can cancel it after six months i'm afraid it's not compulsory but after six months it, they will charge it for this and also just to give you an overview this printer you can print copy scan and this is automatic document feeder that five pages of paper for automatic document feeder it's dual band you can connect it via wi-fi network and usb cable connection like i mentioned i'm going to turn this printer around give you an overview of this printer then we connect this printer to wi-fi network if you look over here you will see a blue light is flashing blue light flashing here signify that the wi-fi is not yet connected once it's connected it will be a steady blue light on before we do anything i want to turn this printer around this printer is very economical and affordable from the back here the power cable three pin power cable is included in the packaging this spot here is for usb cable spot unfortunately usb cable is not included in the packaging we have this at vinyl textile free delivery here in uk this is the serial number for this printer and this is the automatic document feeder automatic document feeder up to that five paper okay for automatic document feeder and uh, turn this printer around here is the scanner flat base scanner you load particular document id card whatever you want to copy or scan on top here and select the function from the features it will do the job this printer this is the honor off button just on top is the honor off button this is the lcd screen and you can see a wi-fi is flashing right now this is the paper tray if you bring this out so here is the paper tray you load particular paper you want four by six a4 paper vera five by seven various paper likewise photo paper you load the photo paper on top okay so this is the for, for photo the top one is for photo the bottom one is for a4 paper and the rest okay so then just going to close this now open this up like i mentioned this printer is using ink cartridges 303 it goes in here it's color explanatory the co color goes to the left the black goes to the right which i'm also going to show you my videos if you have any paper jam open up this section and bring out this cover check for any paper jam and debris at the back and remove it and gently make sure you close close this and bring this back okay make sure you put back the cover here click sound and this is the overview for this printer this printer is very good with photo like i mentioned smart contextual touch screen display this is the touch screen display from this touch screen display it will show you you know it will take select the function you want from here and also um, like i mentioned earlier this printer is best for photo features multi-purpose color printing gear what i want us to do right now is for us to connect this printer to wi-fi network and for us to do that i need you to get your mobile phone we need to go to get hp soft software okay one two three dot hp dot com but you can do this for your mobile phone by going to hp smart app go to google play store and type hp smart app so right now i'm going to google play going to play store okay now what you need to do is type hp smart app on it okay here is HP Smart App. Download it on your mobile phone. Click it open. I'm going to click it open right now on my mobile phone. But before I do that, I want us to first of all switch off the mobile data. Sometimes this interfere with the connection. 
so what i'm going to do right now is first of all switch off my mobile data and make sure that this mobile phone is using only wi-fi network okay so the mobile data is switched off right now it's connect i'm using the wi-fi network data so this is hp smart app click it open Okay, it's open. Now what we need to do is first of all, you can see a bell by the side and a plus sign. Click on the plus sign. Once you click on the plus sign, it will ask you printer setup. Choose a type of printer to add to Smart, HP Smart. Set up a new printer or add a printer that is already set up. So this is a new printer. So we need to click get started with a new printer. Now it will ask you the option you want. Um, whether you want to connect it via a tank cable or Wi-Fi network. So select Wi-Fi network. Okay. Now click continue. Now as you get the printer ready, and make sure the printer is switched on. Uh, place the printer on the flat surface. Then plug it and power on. Connect your mobile phone to Wi-Fi network. Turn on on nearby device permission location. Precisely turn on Bluetooth on your mobile phone. Allow access when prompted. So once you done you done that, I hear everything. Just click continue now it will ask you your location is required click continue click ok and it will ask you allow your location click allow turn your location on the set click ok so, so once you turn your location on then you go back and it will start to look for this printer here we go mv inspire seven seven nine zero zero is found so click on this printer here we go we need to right now put the wi-fi network for this printer so once you turn the bluetooth on and your location it will find the printer which is already found right now so what we need to do is put the wi-fi details for this printer okay and also bear in mind like i mentioned the blue light is flashing here it means that the wi-fi is not yet connected but once it's connected it will be a steady blue light on so what i'm going to do right now is to put the password Okay, once you put the password, make sure you cross check it to make sure the information you put is correct. And if you're happy with it, click enter. Now the next thing is click continue. It will ask you to turn Bluetooth on, click continue. Now HP, allow HP to enable Bluetooth, click allow. Now it's turning on Bluetooth. Okay, and now it's turning on Bluetooth. The next thing is finding the printer. Printer is found. The next thing is it's going to prepare the printer. So right now it's preparing the printer. Now it's asking us tap the check mark on your PC display. So right now you can see a check mark and app is determined to set up printer. Click allow. Okay, so right now you just need to allow it. HP software has been found on your printer. So right now it's processing. Printer prepared. It's connected to Wi-Fi network. Right now, it's obtaining IP. It's already connected on the printer, but you need to wait for this to complete on the app. Okay, you can see the blue light is no longer flashing. It's a steady blue light. So this printer is actually connected. Here we go. Printer is connected to Wi-Fi network. You can see. So right now, this printer is connected. This is how to connect this printer to Wi-Fi network. You just need to follow the instruction, and you can see from the phone here. Once you connect, it will show you printer connected to Wi-Fi network and also show you the network. So click continue. Once you click continue, it will ask you to agree to terms and condition with HP Instant Ink. But because this is tutorial, so I'm going to skip it. But I, I encourage you to do this. Once you reach to six months, then you can cancel the service. But myself, I like to use pay as you go. But um, just this is how to connect this printer. So just gonna gonna follow the process to the end for you to see. Here we go, click continue.
here we go hp introducing hp plus now activate hp plus for for printing smart capability print from anywhere anytime 24 7 print printer security with remote monitoring mobile scan fax and file sharing uh, six months of instant ink included an additional one additional year of hp warranty so if you click continue then you want to activate this but because this is tutorial so i'm going to uh, click do not activate right now they will ask you are you sure yes decline the hp offer so right now i'm going to click continue printer dynamic security notice we just ask you are uh, you go back to the offer or continue so i'm going to click continue here we go it's registering the printer now welcome to hp account i already have an hp account your hp account to enroll for instant ink then this is also an offer if you're happy to go ahead with it then you go ahead but you can also decline it which i'm also going to decline because this is tutorial now it's asking us about uh redeem two months of printing with hp instant ink which i'm going to skip the, the benefit are you sure i want to skip the benefit yes skip the offer or you can click remind me later okay right now it's telling, telling us time to install the ink which i'm also going to show you on my next video how to install the ink skip installation installing the ink now also asking us to load the paper today so i'm going to skip it now about automatic printer updates you can update this automatically and click apply here we go setup complete so right now asking us let's print so if you load the paper tray and load the ink, it will print at, at the document you want. This is how to connect this printer to Wi-Fi network. If you're happy with this tutorial, please do consider to subscribe. You can also skip printing job. Asking you print from other device, skip, not right now. Here we go. So right now, this printer is completed uh, in terms of connecting to Wi-Fi network. It's showing here right now, blue light is here. What we need to do right now, I'm going to show you on my next video how to load the ink cartridges and we'll go from there. If you're happy with this tutorial, please do consider to subscribe. Thank you and stay blessed.